Hey everyone, it's Ryan Patterson uh, with Peerless Network. Thanks for your time and thanks for joining us today for SIP Trunking Made Easy via the Peerless Portal. We, over the next 30 minutes, we've got a lot of great information to share with you. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm going to start by going through the agenda here in the next slide. And uh, we'll do some introductions. Uh, first, I want to introduce you to uh, Dion, my, first myself, I should say. Um, Ryan Patterson, the VP of the channel. Uh, next, we have Dion Johnson on. He's our, one of our top sales engineers uh, with Peerless Network. Uh, Rick Knight is also joining us. Uh, he's the Executive Vice President of Sales and Marketing. Uh, we also have uh, Jamie Arco, who is the Director of uh, Channel Sales for the East. Uh, and we have Gloria Wong, who's the Director of our Channel Sales for the West as well. So we're excited to have them on, uh, but also very excited to have you join us for the next 30 minutes. Got a lot of information to share with you today. I see some new names, so I'm gonna spend a few minutes uh, going through the Peerless overview. Just a little bit about Peerless. Uh, next, we're gonna get right into SIP trunking. It's gonna be all about uh, the Peerless SIP trunking product today, our features, some exciting new features that we're launching today, as well as some pricing. I'm then gonna hand it over to Dion. Uh, and he's going to take from from a quote all the way through the activation of a trunking order, show you how simple and easy it is to do uh, with Peerless. Uh, next, we're going to go through, uh, just spend a few minutes on installation and turn up. Uh, we've got some great promotions uh, going on. Q&A, if we, we have some time at the end, we'd love to do some questions and answers. Uh, please just submit them through the chat, and we'll try to get to as many as possible. Uh, we also, as you saw from the invitation, uh, for those of you that attend uh, through the 30 minutes here, uh, we have some gift cards for the first 50 uh, folks that registered for our webinar. We've got some great, uh, either I believe it's um, DoorDash and, uh, and or uh, Uber Eats uh, gift cards for you guys. So just want to get into a little bit about Peerless Network. Uh, as you may or may not have heard of Peerless, what I like to say is you may not have heard of Peerless, but more than likely you use the Peerless network on a daily basis. We are a nationwide voice services provider. Uh, we started as a wholesale provider for a lot of the UCAS companies, a lot of the CLEX, um, conferencing companies, video and audio. Uh, today we're doing about 10 billion minutes a month in voice services. About four or five years ago, we decided to launch our enterprise channel. Uh, and uh, we do that 100% through the agent program. So we're very excited about that. It's definitely one of our fastest growing segments as well. Uh, we are based in Chicago, about $150 million company. Uh, not too big, not too small, just right, just the perfect size to be able to deliver great uh, services to our customers and our agents. We're really known for our white glove approach, uh, just uh, as, a, as a nice differentiator, as well as our network reliability and, uh, and being a, not, not a huge company, we also can be very innovative and move and change with the industry. The Peerless Network, um, this is a, a network map of all uh, of our network, 100% owned and operated by Peerless. We're in over 200 LADAs. We can service over 93% of the US population. Honestly, what do all these numbers mean? There's hundreds of providers you could choose for your voice services, for your SIP, your UCAS services. You look, at it, you look at all of them and very few of them have a network. Uh, what we can say and what a big differentiator that Peerless has is we operate our voice services over our own voice network, so the buck stops with us. So if you have a problem, uh, an issue, we're not calling 50 under, underlying providers to figure out where it is. We, the buck stops with us. And that's a big differentiator when you're talking about quality and reliability, which is what people need in this, this day and age. So that's a little bit about the Peerless Network. Um, I'm gonna be throwing a lot of information at you today. Certainly we're gonna have time for Q, a few minutes for Q&A, but your channel managers and directors are gonna be here to help uh, follow up after this. Uh, as far as our product and services, I said we're very voice focused. You know, we really don't, are, are not trying to be everything to everyone. We're focused on being the number one voice provider in the industry. Selling UCAS services, SIP trunking services, inbound and outbound, toll-free services. Everything is over the Peerless Portal, uh, and, and Dion will show you some of the benefits of the Peerless Portal. But today, we're gonna really focus on our SIP trunking offering. 
Um, let's talk a little bit about SIP. <laughs> Every, you, you all know that it's a fantastic industry and it's very rapidly growing. Right now, it's about a $7.5 billion industry. And the market says that the uh, market research says that uh, the uh, industry is going to be uh, over 15 billion by 2025. So why are customers choosing SIP over the other services? Flexibility, certainly what we're going to be talking about today. Uh, easier to manage, improve reliability. Uh, and one big thing that's circled and highlighted is speed of deployment. And that's a big thing that we're going to be talking about today with and, and a nice differentiator that we offer with the Peerless Portal. Let's talk about the SIP trunking product that we bring to the market. Uh, you know, we'll, we'll start with the pricing. It's, uh, it's, we have a few different uh, flavors here. Uh, a per SIP trunk is, uh, we're at $4.99, our standard three-year pricing. Uh, an unlimited SIP trunk is $18. Uh, one thing that's very popular, it's been very popular, is a lot of the carriers are getting rid of their older TDM uh, services, is our, is our PRI trunk. That comes with the Edgemark device, and that's just under $115 a month on a three-year term. We are also getting a lot of requests for analog lines or IP analog. We sell them at 12, just, uh, just over $12 a month. You can see our metered rate, that's just our standard rate at just under a penny a minute, very competitive. And for, certainly for larger LD deals, uh, you can get much more competitive than that. The other thing that comes up a lot with, uh, with the older technology is r remote call forwarding, out of rate center DIDs, things like that. That is not a problem with, with the peerless product and, and with SIP trunking. Uh, and certainly we can, we're, we'll be happy to put together some quotes for you. Very feature rich offering. Certainly static and registered uh, IP uh, or SIP trunks. We can do PRI and analog delivery, like I said. Uh, Fail-safe routing, uh, which I'll tell you a little bit more about that in a minute. Uh, load balancing, geo-redundant trunking. All of these things are coming with our trunks. Uh, and so it's a very feature-rich, very redundant uh, product that we put together. Tell you a little bit about the, uh, the load balancing product by talking about a scenario here. So if it's a customer uh, that has multiple uh, PBXs and they want to ba balance the traffic between the two, you can uh, set weight and priority between the, between the two PBXs and balance the traffic between uh, the services. Great redundancy uh, product and, uh, and something we're doing a lot with our partners and we're putting together a, a perfect solution for, for our customers that are looking for a nice redundant quality product. As far as geo redundancy, this is a newer, uh, this is a, a new product to the Peerless Portal that we're going to be offering. Uh, we're very excited about our geo redundancy product. As I mentioned before, we have hundreds of FBCs throughout the country. Somebody that's more of a mission critical application looks at something like geo redundancy. So if we have a primary path at their one PBX uh, and then a secondary, you certainly can put together a very redundant solution by provisioning one path out of one of the peerless SBCs and a second path out of a completely other SBC located in somewhere else in the country. And what we can do is we can establish uh, route labels so that if a customer uh, wants to set up a primary path and if that path fails or if that circuit fails or whatever that's coming in on over, they can have a secondary route uh, that immediately fails over to, to ensure uh, the customer is never going to experience downtime. So we're very excited uh, to, to launch that product or that feature to you guys today. The next um, slide, we're going to talk about fail-safe routing. Some of you may have heard of this uh, product, but essentially it's for if a customer is, is, um, wants to establish a backup path for their DIDs, uh, we're essentially uh, constantly monitoring that primary path or those D, that, that those DIDs are routing on, and they predetermine a destination. So if those DIDs were to go down for a down PBX, power to failure, anything that happens to that particular location, that can pre be immediately rerouted uh, over to that predetermined destination. So we're very excited about adding that to the peerless portal uh, as well. Uh, so. That's kind of the overall, the, the features and the offering that we have uh, for, the, for the SIP trunking. 
uh, with a lot of disaster recovery tools uh, and are able to literally any SIP trunking opportunity that we come across, we've got a great solution for. So we're very excited about that. I talked a little bit about the uh, enterprise session border controllers as well for even small uh, opportunities all the way up to very large enterprise opportunities. Cisco SPA is really for an analog device uh, that, uh, that can deliver a couple analog lines if a customer wants uh, fax uh, or alarms or, or credit card machines, anything like that. Then we have the ribbon series of Edgemark devices for 4806 handles PRIs as well as a handful of analog lines and the 4808 handles mostly analog lines. Uh, and we can go up and, and continue to grow from there. So uh, we've got a full series of, of uh, equipment that we can bring to the table as well for your customers. Uh, and uh, we can either lease those uh, products and services or we can, uh, we can sell them to you or your customer. I'll walk through um, our proposal generator, which will help put together a quote for customers for you guys. Um, I've just logged into the portal and I've clicked on proposal. And we'll step through putting together a quote for a potential customer. Uh, the first thing you'll want to do is give it a name. After that, we have a default greeting message here um, that you can customize and change to your liking. Your contact information will go in this section here. And then we will select the service terms that we want to propose to the customer. For this, I'll go with our 36 months. Then we'll come down to trunking and DID. I'll add a SIP trunk here. Uh, we'll give it a name again. We'll select how many channels we want to include within the SIP trunk. Uh, for this demo, I will also add a PRI trunk. And you'll notice on the right-hand side of the screen here, as I'm entering data, it's automatically calculating uh, the proposal for me. Uh, we'll come down and continue, and we'll add um, 40 DIDs with E911 and CNAM delivery. And then we'll include 1,000 domestic outbound minutes. Um, after we've entered all the data we want, we will hit the generate proposal. And what it will do is put this in a nice PDF file that um, can be saved off your, to your computer and emailed out to the customer that you're sending this proposal to. Uh, comes up with the date and the name of the customer. Uh, your contact information was shown here. And here's the default message that, again, you can change and customize to your liking. Then it gives a little more information about the Peerless Network and who we are, the products and solutions that are offered through the Peerless portal, and a little more background and information on the Peerless portal itself. And now we get into the actual proposal that we're sending out to the customer. Uh, here's the trunk that we created on the proposal, the number of channels, the PRI trunk with the pricing there, the 40 DIDs, and the 1,000 domestic outbound minutes. And down here, it gives the total monthly cost for the customer. Tells them the service term is 36 months. And then the proposal also includes a pricing schedule. Um, this is for a future, if the customer wanted to uh, add additional services, the pricing schedule is included. And then we get to the Peerless Network Support, uh, which explains to a customer how to enter and open a ticket with Peerless. And also included um, within the proposal generator is a escalation list with Peerless that goes all the way up to our president and CEO of the so all of that information is put in a nice PDF file uh, that you can save off to your computer and email out to the customer that you're proposing to offer to. Uh, next, I will show you how to use our portal to build out SIP trunk. Um, so from the portal, I've clicked on SIP trunks here, and it brings up our, the wizard to step through building out a SIP trunk. Uh, the first thing to do here, again, is to give the trunk a name. Select the trunk type, go with the static IP trunk. Uh, the next would be the PBX type. There's a list of PBXs to select from. Uh, for this one, I will go with the asterisk PBX. 
Uh, you have your DPMF options in band or out of band RFC 2833. Three different types of number formatting to select from. I'll go with the E164. Uh, TLS SRTP encryption is an option for the switch trunk. It's simply done by a toggle switch if you want to enable or disable. Next is the PBX location. I will go with Arizona here. Uh, and then fax treatment, none, or we have the option of T38 uh, with fallback to G711. After the config is done, uh, the next step is to add how many channels you want on the SIP trunk. I'll add 35 uh, channels for this. Next is our DID routing tab. This is where the customer wants to receive their traffic from Paralyst. So the IPs for the customer uh, where they want inbound traffic to come. You can have multiple IPs here. Wait. For the UDP signaling port, wait for priority, add route, and I will just show that we can add more than one IP here. All right, after you include the IPs where you want to receive traffic, hit next, and it brings us to the source tab, which is where the customer would send traffic from their network back to Peerless. And multiple IPs can be added here as well, too. All right. After we've um, selected the IP information, next is the codec options where we offer PCMU G711U, G711A, G729, and G729AD. Uh, you can have multiple codecs. So for here, I will add G711 and G729. These can be reordered by simply dragging and dropping to put them in the order that you like. And after we select our codec, we get to the checkout page, and it gives a description of the SIP trunk and channels that we've included on the trunk. And once we hit the Add Trunk button, uh, the trunk is built live real time. The portal actually goes out and communicates with our border controllers. And a live SIP trunk is ready for usage within a matter of minutes. Uh, using the portal. And that concludes building out a SIP trunk and within the Peerless portal. Uh, Ryan, I will turn it back over to you to conclude. Thank you very much, Dion. That was great. Um, I want to highlight a few things. Yeah, I want to highlight a few things uh, there. Uh, number one, that took a total of five minutes uh, to do an entire quote, uh, all the way from the very beginning of the process to place an order. And, and now those uh, 35 SIP trunks are active uh, with the imaginary customer that, that Dion just created. Um, so uh, obviously simple, easy, very intuitive, and and uh, a tool that that uh, we're getting a ton of great feedback from agents out there. How quickly and easily you can not only add customers, but I would say the number one thing that we're getting feedback on is moves, ads, and changes. So once you've established the customer in here, you can literally add one to thousands of SIP trunks in a minute uh, for your customers. And the same goes with our cloud. We're not talking about cloud PBX today, but the same thing goes with cloud PBX uh, with an analog line. PRIs, uh, the same process with, with that Dion could have gone through would take one or two minutes to add a PRI, which would be live and active instantly, but you, as you all know, it needs a piece of equipment, which is automatically provisioned and shipped out that same day. So we can turn a PRI up as quickly as three to five days. Uh, the porting, the porting, there is porting that's involved and, and uh, our project management, and I'll get into uh, the installation of, of uh, these services here in a minute. So uh, as far as SIP trunking installation, we saw, you saw most of it right there was uh, certainly self-install. We're not going to charge you anything to use the portal and install SIP trunks for your account. All you got to do is load an IP address. Uh, there's really no on-site deployment or anything for the majority of our SIP trunking opportunities unless there's an SBC, a PRI, an ATA, something like that that needs to be deployed, and a peerless technician will be dispatched. Uh, install that on site uh, for your uh, for your customer. 
with the PRI, that $115 not only includes the PRI, 23 channel tip trunk PRI, the Edgemark device, but it also includes installation. So there's no charge on a three year other than that $115. Uh, for other deployments, for if a customer wanted an SBC for their SIP trunk uh, service, uh, we would quote that uh, uh, based on size uh, and location. We've de done uh, the deployment of quite a few analog devices as well, uh, analog lines nationwide. Uh, we would do that quote on a, on a uh, per account size location basis, but it would be very competitive. Uh, a project manager is assigned to every account uh, and will oversee the deployment of the services, oversee the uh, installation of any equipment that's necessary, and most importantly, communicate with the customer and the agent uh, as to uh, when the ports are due, when they're scheduled, uh, and, and get that all scheduled and, and activated for the customer. And finally, they'll hand it off to uh, the account, account manager who will be responsible for training the customer and or the agent uh, on the portal uh, and introduce the customer and the agent to the account manager uh, as well uh, that will be assigned to the account. So that's a little bit about the SIP trunking product. We kind of summarize uh, a little bit about why, why peerless. Number one, uh, our portal is a, is a major differentiator uh, that we have in place, makes it very easy to do p business with Peerless, uh, to be able to activate services, puts the control in your hands or your customer's hands to be able to do moves, ads, and changes. Uh, we're, we're very experienced. From day one, we've been offering uh, SIP trunking voice services, uh, and we're very, very good at it, uh, you know, doing, having millions and thousands of SIP trunks as well as billions of minutes on our network. We're not too big, not too small. We're a perfect size to be able to be flexible, uh, customize solutions to you or for you and your customers, uh, as well as we have got an outstanding network, very reliable, very redundant, and some outstanding uh, products uh, we've got in place for you as well on the SIP side. The last slide before we go in, I see we have a few questions on the, in the chat. Uh, last slide uh, I want to go through is our, is our, uh, our Q2 promo slide uh, that right now we're paying five times uh, in the form of a gift card for SIP MRCs. Uh, or if you use the portal to place your order, SIP order will pay you an extra one-time MRC on a three-year term. This promo expires at the end of the month, end of June. Uh, and um, uh, which is the end of the quarter. Uh, so if you have any questions, uh, contact your channel manager, uh, or you can send it to the entire team at channel at peerlessnetwork.com uh, for any more information about the product. So we've got about five minutes. We've got a few questions uh, that we wanna go through. If you have any further questions, uh, and if you wanna submit them through the chat, uh, please do so, or uh, follow up with your uh, channel director and we'll be happy to I answer those questions that way. So, uh, Peerless, uh, what is your, uh, here, let me see, what is your sweet spot uh, for SIP trunking? So, uh, I would say for SIP trunking, for the majority of the, of the services uh, or of SIP trunking, it's really from a very small account all the way up to uh, enterprise, very large enterprise opportunities with big LD minutes. Uh, services. So with the portal, certainly uh, our, our, uh, our sweet spot is, is a large range, uh, but specifically somebody with a 3CX system, a VIA, uh, a Microsoft, these are all systems that we are compatible with, uh, and, and many, many more systems. You saw the list as Dion was going through. Um, so we've got um, certainly a lot of other uh, systems and equipment that we can be compatible with. But as far as a sweet spot, definitely uh, really sit with SIP trunking any size customer, somebody that wants services immediately, uh, somebody that has any of the many systems that we are compatible with uh, are all great fits for us. So really anything SIP trunking. I would, um, what's the, as far as a future roadmap, what was the next question, I believe? Let me see, I thought I saw something about future roadmap. 
Uh, future roadmap, um, as far as uh, our SIP trunking product, as far as Peerless in general, we continue to expand our product set uh, with, with voice services, enhanced features, things like that on the SIP trunking and the UCAS side. Uh, we are expanding into Canada uh, as well as the UK. Uh, so you'll see uh, certainly uh, call origination and termination uh, in both those markets, but also eventually SIP trunking uh, in those markets as well. So that's, that's, uh, certainly something additional that, that, uh, that, you know, the peerless, uh, marketing team and operations is, is continuing to work on. But right now we're continuing to focus on voice services, uh, UCAS, SIP, uh, and expanding and growing those products, uh, and, and continue to be, um, certified with a lot of other different, uh, equipment vendors out there. So. Uh, that's really all we had. We, we ended in 26 minutes, um, got it through a lot of information at you today. So if you have any, uh, further questions, like I said, please direct those to, uh, the, your channel team. Uh, and we, we appreciate, uh, the partnership and, uh, we look forward to continuing to work with all of you, uh, and have a great day. Thanks a lot. Thank you.